a major settlement for a big mistake four years ago. You may remember even city inspectors called the demolition of a little village smokestack a botched job. Now the company behind it is writing a big check and the door is still open to join the class action lawsuit. Chris Ty is in Little Village for us to sort it out. What is now a warehouse for a big box chain was once a coal smokestack. You may remember it was four years ago when they demolished it and it created a sequence of events that threw out allegations of government mismanagement and racism from those who live in this largely Mexican American working class village. People felt a huge uh, boom sound. It was a Saturday morning the day before Easter. The explosion came first, then the clouds of dust followed. And a trembling, almost like an earthquake, and people didn't know what to make of it. When you see this dust cloud just coming at you. The implosion of an industrial smokestack at the former Crawford coal fired generating power plant was flagged as a potential problem long before Hillco Redevelopment Partners detonated it. The city's inspector general found they went forward despite warnings 213 days before that the dust from an event like this is almost cataclysmic. And look from this drone video as the dust cascades over Little Village. Very disappointed in our elected officials and the politicians that didn't stand up for this community as if nothing could be done. Something could be done. This week we learned a judge has approved a $12 million settlement between residents and the demolition company. And you can still join in, but you have to have been living in the neighborhood at the time as Juan Rangel was. I really believe that if this were any other community, Lincoln Park, any others, this would have never happened. I feel good. It's four years later, our community received justice. That cannot happen ever again in any community. If you want to find out if you or someone else in your family may be eligible to be part of this class action suit, there's a website, littlevillagesmokestack.com. We have a link to that up on our website.